Hi, kitty cats. It's still July 11th, still about 7.20 in the morning. So after the psychiatric evaluation, I had to talk to a plastic surgeon because the plastic surgeon wants to know, you know, how much to augment and also wanted to know, you know, what kind of tissue he's working with downstairs. The, I don't want to go into a whole lot about how bras are created. Maybe someday if there's interest, I can do a video about bra sister sizes and just the geometry involved in that. But I was given, um, my band size is 42. So I wear a 44B bra. And I was given implants that were pretty much the smallest. It was 450 uh, cc, 450 mils that when I put it into the bra, I thought it's a little bit too big. So I asked, you know, can we go, can we size down one, 50, drop it by 50 mils. And they actually had to order, like the guy calls up the implant company and says, hey, do you, do you have, you know, this in stock? Because the way the geometry works on a, a, a chest, because if you think of this as just a square, you have truncated cones, that's a circle, truncated cones and this, the diameter of the circle changes based on the, the uh, width the cross of your chest. So I am getting special like order, <laughs> knockoff type, not knockoff, special order breast implants uh, for my size and then um, for the projection that I want. One thing that's cool, I actually, the surgeon says I have a decent amount of breast tissue so he can actually put the implant on top of the muscle and there's value to that. Uh, he doesn't have to break the capsule of the muscle which is very good. That means easier um, healing, he easier recovery, recovery but he also said by putting it on top and then having my natural breast tissue cover it, it's going to look more natural and feel more natural. So, so that's what I got for breast implants. That's what's going on there. I think I got one more, and I don't know when these are going to be released, so here we go.